Are you living in the real world? I feel it in the water. I feel it in my cheeks. I smell it in the air. Much that once was is lost, for none now live who remember it. It began with ye old funk. Before all things, the funk grooved an eternal, funky, cool modality. And from this melody came forth the Thalia, and ye old funk was pleased. The Thalia grooved in harmony and came to a great crescendo from whence came the planets, stars, and plant life. Ye old funk then went into a buckwild solo bringing forth life to the universe. But when Thalia wanted a solo of his own and went out beyond the great yon yon and deviated from the groove. This Thalia named Mediocrates grooved off beat and out of tune, never harmonizing with the other Thalia or ye old funk. Hence he was outcast and became jealous of the others. Mediocrates brought forth into existence cosmic dissonance and all of the evils that followed. Greed, sloth, jealousy, all seeped into various crevices of reality. The ones who brought evil and famine followed and worshipped Mediocrates, and it was still his plan to corrupt all of those that would take his words as truth. A chief follower of Mediocrates was Beth Jezos, a powerful, ruthless old fuck who lusted for power. He brought forth darkness and sorrow anywhere he sauntered. One by one, the free planets of the cosmos fell to Mediocrates and his horde, but there were some who resisted. A last alliance of heroes from different nations, planets, and galaxies ran buckwild on Bezos, and on the heavenly plains they fought for the freedom of the universe. With the help of the Thalia, Mediocrates and his armies were driven back, and he was captured, taken away beyond the great Yon Yon. The Thalia then crafted items of great power to give to those houses who stood strong amidst the face of doom. These relics, as they were later known, not only gave great powers to those planets who housed them, but also a way for the Thalia to keep at bay the evils that still lingered. and some things that should not have been forgotten were lost. History became legend. Legend became myth. And for 10,000 years, life and the Thalia lived in harmony. They grew so hard into a funky, cool modality that they became blind to the growing evils in the outskirts of the universe. The powerful Beth Jezos has set forth his army of darkness to collect the relics of power and to free his master, Mediocrates. One crucial relic, the Buckstone, remains on Funkatron, and here we find our heroes. A great council is happening. Like the days of yore, neighboring planets and star systems have sent their greatest heroes to Funkatron in hopes to form an alliance, a fellowship, a funk,